First off, we gotta mill the grain. Next, we mash. We get that grain in there, get it all stirred up real nice and nice and shit, and we mash. We will be mashing at 156 degrees for about 45 minutes. So almost there, pretty close, getting closer. Now that the mash is done, we will begin pumping hot water, sparging the grain bed and running off into the boil kettle. As you can see that as the wort is exiting the bottom of the mash tun, water is being pumped in over the top to clean it. Once again, the brew dog. Did you know that the hops are closely related to marijuana? Now that it's starting to boil, we will add the hops for about 90 minutes. This will end up being a Munich lager when it's all done. Now it just has to cook. All right, now that we're done boiling, it's important to get the temperature down as quick as possible, so we use a chiller. This is a counterflow chiller where water goes one way and the beer goes and also we're going to whirlpool everything to try and get all the sediment to the center. So we start going here with the whirlpool. And while it's chilling we're going to get the fermenter ready. It's all nice and clean. Just get it put together here and get ready for the beer. Now for the fun part. We oxygenate the beer, chill it one more time and send it through the plumbing down to the basement. Little demonstration of the chiller here. The beer's going in at about 145 degrees, and it's coming out at about 70 degrees. That's chilled. As you can see, I got tired of lugging heavy buckets of beer downstairs, so I ran my own plumbing down to the fermenter in the basement. And I built brew dog. <laughs> Roof. Roof. Now we're going to add the yeast. As you can see, I got this stuff woken up yesterday already with a little bit of beer. It's going to go into the fermenter and start doing work. Now that the yeast is in, you can see this is actually a chilled fermenter. It's at 71 degrees. It's going to drop down to about 55. And that's pretty much it for the brew process. Now I just got to clean all this shit up. I'll be back in a few days to show you what's going on with the, uh, the beer down in the basement.